Hello, my name is Brian Johnson, and I'm a science editor of World Book Encyclopedia. I'm here to talk about a dinosaur named Cynoceropteryx. Cynoceropteryx has forever changed the way we think about dinosaurs. It was discovered by a Chinese farmer and amateur fossil hunter in 1996. The find was controversial from the start because the fossil contained what appeared to be feathers. These feathers were simple filaments that somewhat resembled down. Initially, Many scientists were skeptical that the structures in the fossil were truly feathers. Some claimed they were collagen, which is a kind of connective tissue. But after years of debate, most scientists accepted that the structures really were feathers. Even then, some argued that Cynoceropteryx was a bird, but not a dinosaur. However, it clearly lacked wings, or even wing-like limbs. Many other features of its skeleton show that it was a dinosaur, not a bird. In time, as paleontologists found additional fossils of feathered dinosaurs, most scientists came to agree that feathers first developed among theropods. The theropods were a major group of meat-eating dinosaurs. Their most famous member was Tyrannosaurus. Birds were one type of feathered theropod, but there are many other feathered dinosaurs, including Cynoceropteryx. One of the things that might seem curious about Cynoceropteryx is that it lived long after the first birds. It lived about 120 million years ago, while well, the first birds lived more than 160 million years ago. So why does Cynoceropteryx show that dinosaurs developed feathers before birds if it lived much later? The key is that scientists think an adaptation such as feathers arose only once. Thus, any animal that has feathers is a descendant of the first animals that had feathers. We know that birds have feathers, and we know that Cynoceropteryx had feathers. But Cynoceropteryx did not descend from birds. The last common ancestor of birds in Cynoceropteryx was a theropod dinosaur that lived before the appearance of birds. So feathers must have appeared among theropod dinosaurs before there were birds. How many dinosaurs had feathers? For now, that's an open question. It's clear that many, if not all, celerosaurs, which are sometimes called bird-like dinosaurs, had feathers. Tyrannosaurus was a celerosaur, so it is likely that it had at least some feathers. In fact, scientists recently discovered the fossil of a close relative of Tyrannosaurus, and it was covered in a coat of downy feathers, much like Cynoceropteryx. Did other theropods have feathers? In 2012, scientists announced that a dinosaur called Scyromimus had feathers. Scyromimus was a megalosaur, a group of theropods that appeared relatively early. Megalosaurs were not closely related to bird-like dinosaurs. So this discovery pushes the origin of feathers back further, because again, the last common ancestor of Scyromimus and other feathered dinosaurs must also have had feathers. Today, many scientists believe that feathers appeared very early among theropods, and all of them may have had the ability to grow feathers to some degree. Now we should note that even if theropods all descended from a feathered animal, some may not have grown any feathers. Scientists would say that these dinosaurs were secondarily featherless. To offer an analogy, all flightless birds alive today descended from birds that could fly. These birds are secondarily flightless. Did any other dinosaurs have feathers? Dinosaurs such as ankylosaurs and duck-billed dinosaurs are ornithsixians, a different branch of dinosaurs. Paleontologists have found fossils of Ornithsixians that have structures that some have identified as simple feathers. Many scientists are skeptical that the structures in these fossils are actually feathers. But if they are, it would show that a tremendous variety of dinosaurs could grow feathers. Scientists won't be able to settle these questions until they find additional fossils. But Cynoceropteryx will always mark an important turning point when scientists found the first direct evidence that dinosaurs other than birds had feathers. Cynoceropteryx was only one of many feathered theropods that lived in the age of dinosaurs.